So the best thing about this is the fact that I'll be able to play for however many hours that I want and not have to worry about Hello and welcome to another Nihongo Gamer video. As you know, I like to play games on my Nintendo Switch and one of the best things about the Nintendo Switch is that you can also play it in TV docked mode. When you're connected to a TV, you can use something like an arcade stick. Fortunately, the dock has these USB ports on it. However, when you take it out of the dock, what I had to do in order to be able to play with my arcade stick was I actually had to go and get one of these adapters. And you'll have seen this from a previous video. The USB port on this comes out the bottom. And if you have the cable, actually, I forgot my adapter. Hold on, where's my, where's my adapter? It's stuck to the, it's eating me. Okay, so on the bottom, which the only port on the switch is on the bottom like this. And of course, if you were to use actual t Oh my goodness. Uh, has that ever happened to you? Okay, when you're playing in tabletop mode, you can see that you won't be able to rest this on a table because this cable is now in the way. And so what you have to do is you have to go and buy one of these stands, but there is a problem. Now, because the only port on the Nintendo Switch, which is this thing here on the bottom, now that this is taken up, you can't charge the Switch and play at the same time. So if you're going to be playing with yourself connected to your arcade stick, you'll only be able to play until the battery dies, and then you'll have to plug it back into your dock or into your AC adapter so that you can charge it again and play. A company called Hori has thought about this, and a whole year and a half later, we finally have a product that allows you to charge and play at the same time. I know, 2018. Aren't we glad we have it now? For the grand total of 38.18 American dollars, you can buy a piece of plastic that allows you to charge your Switch and stand it up and play with your arcade stick at the same time. And we're going to be testing that out today. So this is the product we've got. It's called the, what is it? It's the specifically for tabletop mode Portable USB hub stand for Nintendo Switch official Nintendo licensed product, but it is created by a company called Hori. Here it says Juden Shinagara Asoberu. This means that you can charge while playing. Now that's the important feature on here because you weren't you weren't able to on any of the stands that I could find. Other things you might like to see about this product. Actually, I'm a little bit impressed. It says that you can hook up to four different accessories on here. Four separate USB devices plugged into it. So that probably means that it has five ports, four USB-A ports and one USB-C port, but we will find out soon enough. It also shows you that you can have it at a number of set angles. There's no, there's no angle that's straight up at 90 degrees, unfortunately. Let's open the box. This seems like the most efficient way to open the box to get it out of the packaging. What's this? An instruction manual. To use this product, take it out the box and uh, use it. So we just chuck that out of the way. And this is, mmm, it's actually very nice and compact. It's got a number of caution things on here. Make sure your Nintendo Switch is updated with the latest software. Now, I think this could actually be important because certain dock style products, I think, have been known to brick the Switch. So just make sure that you're updated to the latest system software. I guess technically it's a dock, but it doesn't have HDMI output. The whole point of this is so that you don't need an extra TV just to be able to use the whole USB port extensions. Now, I'm just gonna rip this plastic off like so. Just, uh, I'll just stick that. Stick that on. And this is the product itself. There's a little button here on the side. You push that and that locks it in place. And then you have to flick it all the way around like so. It comes around the other side and now it's in a position where you can actually use it. So this, this is the highest possible angle. It should sit like this and your switch will sit on top. System update. Ja -ja How about that? It's nice and compact. It's barely there underwear for your switch. Super nice and compact, and then when you're done with it, you just take the switch out, press the button, and Bob's your uncle. He might not really be your uncle, but Bob's probably your uncle. They've really gone in and thought about the fact that the USB connector, that could get damaged. Oh wow, it... So the USB connector actually rotates. That's interesting. It keeps it flexible so that it can't snap off if you pull the switch off at an angle. That's so wonderful. Hori, you get 10 out of 10 just for this. You can have it at your 30 degree angle or your 40 degree angle. 
whatever you're going for. You can even have it at a nice shallow angle like so. This is gonna be perfect. I'm so excited about this. How long has this been here? Oh dear. As you can see on the side here, we've got two USB-A ports on that side. And on the other side, two more USB-A ports and the charging port. So if I'll just take the AC adapter here and plug that in. And it actually is for AC adaptive this is for the charger only. And I guess we can just plug the arcade stick into here. And what's really nice is that we knew, knew longer, we no longer need this USB-C adapter. It's actually USB-A on the port. So just plug that in here. I plug the charger in here and we should be good to go. Check this out. Oh, look, see? You can actually see I'm uh, controlling it with my head. Finally, my teacher's advice paid off. I've learned how to use my head. So let's set it up properly and have a look what it's like to have a proper tabletop switch arcade with this on here. This is gonna look, this is look, this is gonna be so good. All right, so let's put the arcade stick in here. Needs something to rest it on. How about the original switch dock? Oh yeah, that's good. Let's plug the arcade stick into one of these USB ports. Let's just plug this in here like so. Yes, it is working perfectly. Nice, all right. What we really need to see is if now plugging in the USB-C Nintendo charging adapter also functions. So we're just gonna turn this around to the side so you can see. Just plug that in there. Oh, sick, it actually totally works. So hopefully you can see there, it is now charging and we do have control. We are. This is so awesome. So I'm able to charge and play and using this USB device at the same time. So awesome. Yes! Ah. The best thing about this is the fact that I'll be able to play for however many hours that I want. And not have to worry about the battery dying. So even if there's like a combo that I haven't got and it's going to take me a couple hours because I'm just garbage at the game. It doesn't matter, I can spend as many hours as is necessary learning this game. And just so that you can see, I'll just show you that this is the medium angle. I think there may be one more. Yeah, there's an, there's an even more. This is, I don't know what angle this is, but it's like 30 degrees. If you're looking straight down at it, maybe if you're sitting above like so, you can have it at a very shallow angle. You know? Or you can have it at <laughs> completely, well, almost completely flat. You can have it at the angle we just had it at, or I think this, this is actually the 60 degree angle. This is the most upright you can have it. And actually, unless you're literally having your face right down here, you don't need it at this angle. If you're looking slightly down at it, you know, obviously if you have it on a surface, like on a table, then maybe you want it at a steep angle. But if you're gonna have it right in front of the stick, like so, this is perfect, check this out. This, this angle is so good. This is so awesome. Oh yes, feels so good. Except for one problem, didn't change the music. That's way better. If you don't have the right music, it's just, it's just what, what is the point? I would say that probably the best thing about this product really is that, you know, one, it's incredibly well made, it's incredibly well thought out, it has pretty much everything you could ever want. It's got four of these USB-A ports, it's got the charging port, here, so you got you got one, two, three, four on here, which is superb. Plus, you've got the fact that it's portable. It's really well made, so it's not going to you know get damaged because look, it protects itself when it's folded up. That's fantastic. Is it pricey? Yeah, it's a little bit pricey, but you know, compared to the other docks that don't actually have any ports on them at all, I'm really impressed. Anyway, that is all for now. Just wanted to show you this excellent product. I don't know where the box is. I've thrown it somewhere, but for your Nintendo Switch to be able to connect to an arcade stick at most four complete separately com four completely separate USB devices in not including the charger so five ports one for this four actual ports for devices plus it's really really convenient it protects itself i think design wise it is an absolute triumph i'm so happy that we finally have something like this this is how big it is compared to my hand i have i don't know how you would describe my hand i would say a fairly average to large ish hand but this is super com super pocketable oh here we go I'll just show you compared to the Switch, this is how big it is. It's really, really easy to carry around. Highly recommend this. 
especially if you have an arcade stick and you want to be able to play, because it does happen, you know, when you're like playing Switch on the TV, someone comes home, they want to watch their favorite drama and it's only on right now, you've got to go and then you're like, oh, but now I can't play with my arcade stick because I haven't got any battery power and now you can actually just plug it into your tabletop dock. Use the actual Switch screen itself, itself, itself. Plug in your arcade stick, plug in your charger, and you're good to go. The Hori, I'm gonna find out what it's called. The Hori Tabletop Mode Portable USB Hub Stand for Nintendo Switch. It may be called something else when it goes into English, maybe it's already available in English, but this is the Japanese version, so that's what it's called here. I hope you have enjoyed this Nihongo Gamer video. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, share the links and all that great stuff, and I'll see you next time. This is so awesome, I've been waiting so long for this. Okay, where's the stop button?